ಸರ್ ಲೈವ್ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಗಿದೆ ಸರ್ ಎಲ್ರಿಗೂ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಇಂದಿನ ಈ ಒಂದು ಆನ್ಲೈನ್ ಡಿಜಿಟಲ್ ತರಬೇತಿ ಕಾರ್ಯಕ್ರಮಕ್ಕೆ ಎಲ್ಲರನ್ನು ಸ್ವಾಗತಿಸ್ತೇನೆ ಈಗಾಗಲೇ ನಾನು ಕಳಿಸಿರ್ತಕ್ಕಂಥ ಇ ಫ್ಲೈಯರ್ ನಲ್ಲಿ ತಿಳಿಸಿರೋ ರೀತಿನಲ್ಲಿ ಪದ ಸ್ಕ್ರಿಪ್ಟ್ ಸಾಫ್ಟ್ವೇರ್ ಆ ಕುರಿತು ಇವತ್ತು ಇಂಗ್ಲಿಷ್ ನಲ್ಲಿ ಉಪನ್ಯಾಸ ಇರಲಿದೆ ನಾನು ನೇರ ವಿಚಾರಕ್ಕೆ ಹೊರಡ್ತೇನೆ ಕಳೆದ ಎರಡು ತಿಂಗಳಿಂದ ನಾನು ಸುಮಾರು ಇದೇ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ನಲ್ಲಿ ಹಲವಾರು ವಿಚಾರಗಳನ್ನ ಕುರಿತು ಸಾಕಷ್ಟು ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ತೆಗೆದುಕೊಂಡಿದ್ದೇನೆ ಇವತ್ತು ಪದ ಸಾಫ್ಟ್ವೇರ್ ಅನ್ನ ಸಂಪೂರ್ಣಗೊಳಿಸಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಅನ್ಕೊಂಡಿದ್ದೇನೆ ನೇರವಾಗಿ ನನ್ನ ಇ ಫ್ಲೈಯರ್ ಅನ್ನ ಈಗ ನೋಡೋಣ ಅಲ್ಲಿಂದ ಪ್ರತಿ ಬಾರಿ ನಾನು ಆರಂಭ ಮಾಡತಕ್ಕಂಥದ್ದು ರೂಢಿ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂಡಿದ್ದೇನೆ ಪಿರಮಿಡ್ ಸ್ಪಿರಿಚುವಲ್ ಸೊಸೈಟೀಸ್ ಮೂಮೆಂಟ್ ಪಿ ಎಸ್ ಎಸ್ ಎಂ ಕರ್ನಾಟಕ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರೀ ಆನ್ಲೈನ್ ಡಿಜಿಟಲ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಈಸ್ ಆನ್ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜ್ ಟೆಕ್ನಾಲಜಿ ಅಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅಪ್ಲಿಕೇಶನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಕಂಡಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆನ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಸಾಟರ್ಡೆ ಸೆವೆನ್ ಪಿ ಎಂ ಟು ಏಟ್ ಥರ್ಟಿ ಪಿ ಎಂ ದಿಸ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಈಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದ ಸೀರೀಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಲೆಕ್ಚರ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಡೆಮೋ ಆನ್ ದ ಸ್ಪೀಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ವಾಯ್ಸ್ ಟೈಪಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜಸ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಲೇಷನ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಲಿಟ್ರೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜಸ್ ಬೇಸಿಕಲಿ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಕನ್ನಡ ಟು ತೆಲುಗು ಅಂಡ್ ಅದರ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜಸ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಕ್ರಿಪ್ಷನ್ ಅದರ್ ಟಾಕ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಸಿನ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಟೂ ಮಂತ್ಸ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಬೀನ್ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ದಿಸ್ ಲೆಕ್ಚರ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಮೋಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ನ್ಯೂ ಕಮರ್ಸ್ ಐ ವಾಂಟೆಡ್ ಟು ಗಿವ್ ಸಮ್ ಇನ್ಪುಟ್ಸ್ ಟು ಸಿ ಮೈ ವಿಡಿಯೋಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಎನಿಬಡಿ ಕನ್ಫರ್ಮ್ ದಟ್ ದ ಸ್ಕ್ರೀನ್ ಈಸ್ ವಿಸಿಬಲ್ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಮೇಡಮ್ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಮಮತಾ ಮಂಜುನಾಥ್ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಮೇಡಮ್ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ just now uh, i was introducing the topic of this program yes. and uh, today's topic uh, i explained uh, regarding this script software in my previous class i have given <coughs> the same subject uh, in kannada language now in this uh, class the medium of instruction will be english the lecture will be in english and the demo will be both kannada and telugu the base languages indian languages so those who have missed my previous class they might have seen the video or otherwise no problem they can uh, follow my lectures and demo in english in this class today is june 25th today's topic is pada software that is script software and its features already i have introduced the majority of the features of this pada software and we have used it kannada and telugu and the very important feature that uh, conversion of uh, the ascii text to unicode text uh, i have to cover today and um, mainly i have introduced and i have used pada ime in the majority of the classes previous classes today i want to introduce the editor of this pada i mean Uh, editing environment and the application software pada is a script software which comprises two things two aspects one ime and another is pada pad or i can call it as pada editor pada editor is a word processor wherein we can type uh, any indian languages and the interface of this uh, software is both in english and kannada since uh, my good friend uh, mr lohit uh, d shivmurthy from davangere has developed this has given the user interface in kannada and english and this is unicode based application software which uh, support all indian languages and it, it supports the major major uh, keyboard layouts uh, my basic principle is i have introduced only one keyboard layout which is very easy to use and very phonetic and uh, uh, very easy to practice also 
and speed typing is very uh, very much possible within no time if you know english speed typing in my previous classes already i have explained regarding the keyboard layout a single keyboard layout which caters for all indian languages if you learn only one keyboard layout if you are a new uh, student for this um, technology usage and all in computers especially the indian languages if you learn only one keyboard layout you can type in all indian languages based on the phonetics and today the main and major feature of this pada script software is transliteration facility so let us know what is the meaning of this transliteration and what is the difference between the translation and the translation uh, transliteration and uh, what are all the uses of this transliteration and of course pada editor may not be a very good processor for you comparatively uh, especially with the regards to the international level word processors like uh, microsoft uh, office that is word but pada editor has got uh, many good features with reference to indian language usages and it has got very good fonts also as usual uh, i being a kannadiga and uh, kannada language computing student i have a little bit expertise in uh, this uh, kannada language computing and uh, i know a little bit of indian languages also uh, keeping base languages as telugu and kannada comparatively i have been explaining the concepts of this indian language technology usage especially the typing keyboard layout and speed typing keyboard tutors mm, and how to use indian languages in all windows applications so one such application is the very easy word processor very popular word processor that is microsoft word in my last class i have explained how to use this um script software in other applications also like excel powerpoint etc now let us move on to the two aspects of this uh very good pada uh, script software the main two components in this pada script software are one the pada editor that is editing environment and the pada ime let me directly go to this what do you mean by this ime many people will ask this ime means it is input method editor that means it's a, a word given by uh, the technologists and the software developers input method input means whatever we key in this uh, uh, in uh, computers and uh, mobile smartphones input whatever the input we uh, either it may be through pressing the keys using keyboards or voice typing uh, whatever we give the input into this uh, digital gadgets that is called input what is the method of this what is the editing also in in input method editors so previously we were calling this as keyboard drivers font is there to display the characters the scripts of languages and for rendering these fonts we used to use this keyboard especially the for english it is qwerty keyboard is very popular qwerty keyboard has got 26 characters and other numeric pad and other characters as you know for even indian languages we are using the same keyboard by mapping the basic characters of indian languages and as the qwerty keyboard itself is the base for the layout is based for indian languages based on the phonetic that is sounds 
we have mapped the characters already i have explained in my previous classes now let me directly go for this feature of pada pad okay he has called this the developer shivamurthy has called this editor or uh, this editing environment as pada pad the version is 5.x.6 so if you can see this madam can you see the screen yes sir yes sir it's visible okay it is visible thank you see this is just like a um, just like this uh, ms word see this is ms word you can see the word like this i used to call this as a sheet of paper wherein we can write the indian languages writing means it is typing so you can see file name tab that is insert page layout so here document 1 here it is microsoft word so if you open this as usual any window standard windows it is minimize maximize and close buttons are there this is called the menu bar this is menu items this is drop down menus so this is typing environment so ms word is called as a word processor likewise here pada pad is also a word processor wherein we can type anything we require here he has given this untitled one document in one script software that is one pada pad multiple documents can be opened and typed here because this supports all indian languages each indian language document can be separately opened and saved for transliteration purpose he has given the concept of the opening multiple documents very easily and of course in word also we can use multiple documents and we can open the windows parallelly horizontally and vertically here the feature is like this as usual it is file everything is as usual here new open save save as close tab recent files print preview print print setup so in word we used to have save as feature here it is export to pdf this is very very important feature previously we used to install the pdf creators externally nowadays the software pro uh, developers they have given the built in features for save as feature as pdf also and exporting to pdf and importing also facilities are there and this is as usual a word processor and edit also very common insert zwj z w o n j i will come to these points later and formatting is there script is very very important here you can see in the script menu item the drop down is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 ten languages are there english is by default kannada is number 1 telugu is number 2 serially it is like this and keyboard is phonetic nudi kp rao in script transliteration keyboard and phonetic 2 right now i don't want to explain all these features here if you are already a user of indian languages either kannada or telugu you will be knowing the input method editor that is keyboard driver you will be learning something uh transliteration or phonetic uh if you are a nudi user in kannada nudi that is kp rao layout is very popular and it is uh, standard layout of government of karnataka for using kannada in computers and all other electronic devices 
so in this script uh, pad that is pada pad script and keyboard drop down menus are very important to learn now see here script what is uh, which language is denoted or which language is selected here madam canada sir canada is selected <coughs> in keyboard which language uh, which uh, keyboard layout is selected kp rawl yes kp yeah. rawl layout is selected good and of course whenever i want to uh, give the demo in uh, other than kannada language i will uh, change that language just by showing you also explaining about that and one more uh, menu item is there in this pada pad it is tools see in this tool insert is there insert a picture and table and of course inserting a picture and table is not a major feature every word processor has got that likewise in this uh, pada pad also you can insert a picture and a table but the very 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 important feature is this unicode script converter today i want to introduce this concept of how to select a language script and how to select a keyboard which is well versed with our practice a keyboard which you know very well and the keyboard which you want to practice we have to set we have to select that before going to going for this uh, practice of typing or editing or corrections anything it may be and uh, coming to this indian languages concept conversion of script is possible based on this unicode standards previously in my previous classes i have explained you in detail regarding the standards let us understand something regarding this standards what do you mean by standard just i want to show one image here uh it's okay today i was making some preparation for today's class in the evening i just tried to install some ascii telugu fonts which i was not having on my system since i wanted to show you the ascii difference as the difference between the ascii font and unicode font in my previous class i have explained it by in in my demo by uh, showing it in kannada but in this class since it is a english um, lecture class and uh, many more users may be interested other than kannada as a standard basic indian languages other than kannada telugu is my uh, a little bit i know that's why i chose this ascii telugu font it is very astonishing and it is natural that uh, nowadays nobody will support for the ascii telugu fonts see here one comment i want to read here there was no common telugu ascii structure for the old fonts so each vendor used different telugu fonts with different keyboard layouts this makes difficult with telugu users as they need to install each telugu font from different websites very beautiful comment i i i want to read it out once again try to understand what i am telling technically a little bit technical as users it is very important for us to understand the the concept of the standards why standards are required either it may be telugu or it may be kannada or it may be any language without standards we cannot use the language scripts in digital devices i was mentioning that i was trying to download the old legacy fonts of telugu but i could not get that because there was no common telugu ascii structure for the old fonts 
So each vendor use different Telugu fonts with different keyboard layouts. This makes difficult with the Telugu users as they need to install each Telugu font from different websites. So here you just remove Telugu name, you add Indian languages. It may be Canada, Hindi, English, uh, sorry, not English, English is international one. Uh, likewise, any Indian language, you take it for example. We have to select, there is no structured uh, uh, technical fonts. Each vendor, he has used his own style, his own encoding system, wherein the compatibility question comes. The text typed in one software developed by one developer will not be of use at all by another environment, the user who is using tech, for example, Akriti and uh, uh, Shilipi is there. Akriti, Akriti fonts are there and Akriti keyboard layout is also there, driver is there. The total solution is from Akriti only. If you have used Akriti fonts and typed some language text, if you want to share it to another user, at other end also, the user should have the Akruti software only, then only it can be used. See, that was the constraints. And even the developers uh, over a period of time, they have used versions, different, different versions, uh, just to avoid the piracy and all, just, just for their business interest, they have changed the encoding system also. If the old text is being or in the new, uh, versions of their own softwares, uh, the reading problem would have come, the conversion problem would have come, the compatibility would have come. So to overcome all these things, the government of India has formulated this ISCI, like this uh, ASCII, American National Standard Code for Information Interchange. Just they have changed that, uh, removed that word American, they added Indian. So it become ISCI, Indian standard. Indian standard means, of course, ANSI only, characters are only ANSI only. Same, all Indian languages are mapped properly, technically, so as to use it very easy, easy format and uh, conversions to convert this uh, text conversion, transliteration, and also compatibility problems were all uh, removed and one keyboard layout uh, was enough to type all Indian languages. That keyboard layout was called as Inscript keyboard layout and the encoding standard was ISCI encoding standard. I am talking about some technology and technical aspects which is very important to understand. And of course, if you are a new user to these Indian languages, you can forget about all standards because every standards have been set now and uh, you can directly use the compatibilities. I am talking about the problems faced by the old users and the new technology. I always uh, use this approach of problems and solutions concept. The approach of problem, problems and solutions. Of course, I am not talking about age-old uh, decades uh, thing. Now, nowadays, many people, they are not well versed with this Unicode technology and Unicode fonts. I wanted to tell you all these basic concepts because if you know the concepts very well, you can, on your own, you can solve your problems. Problem, solution, that is troubleshoot depends upon the level of your understanding. I am trying to put it in nutshell, though you are a common user without any technical background, it is your bounded duty to know uh, a little bit uh, technical aspects of this font and its encoding and the keyboard driver or input method editor and each font will be rendered by typing by using this keyboard drivers. And there is a relationship between the font 
that is the scripts and typing methodology mapping is there we have to learn that here i want to compare the english language and indian languages with regard to rendering display and typing that is keyboard driver display is okay nothing to do with the, the technology whatever you see on the screen scalable fonts are there even english will be scalable that can be colored and the font style can be changed likewise all indian languages also the font is there regarding the nq previously there were only 256 character spaces in ascii and iski so that means encoding was old nowadays the encoding system has been doubled manifolded so 16 bit encoding text encoding has come so now the operating system like windows it can understand uh, the indian languages from the from the scratch it can recognize the indian language scripts because the unicode has become standard of operating system and standards of applications and standards of script softwares there are standards encoding standards are there based on the standards and the space and technology 65000 characters have been uh, character spaces have been provided by using this 16 bit encoding system nowadays the operating system or 64 bit operating system have come the speed of the putting the speed of the operating systems os has been manifolded that is increased a lot so according to that even the language computing technology has been elevated like anything so keeping in this a little bit of technology now let us go for directly go for this uh, concept of using only one tool only one script software for all Indian languages just by learning only one keyboard layout and only one encoding. Previously, there were concepts of monolingual font. Then the concept was evolved to bilingual font. Nowadays, it is multilingual font. Try to understand the scenario. If you are using a monolingual font even today it will be of no use you will be held up in only printing your text in a printer or maximum dtp that's all the same text cannot be exchanged over the platforms like uh, 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 other operating systems and uh, uh, other uh, digital medias like uh, internet smartphones and in social media, your text will be obsoleted if you are using own monolingual fonts. If you are using multilingual, I mean uh, bilingual fonts, it will cater for English and other one single Indian language. And we will be in Indian context only. If at all you are using monolingual, you will be in your, your, your text will be relevant in only one state or one language speaking community. If you are using the multi, I mean uh, uh, bilingual fonts, it will be useful in uh, the uh, in the environment of uh, languages um, known people by, uh, I mean I mean two two uh, language environment. That is next comes uh, this uh, multilingual environment, multilingual fonts. Whenever the standards are increased that i mean standards were set and implemented the things have become very easy now and if you are new to indian language computing and if you are new to use these computers and mobile gadgets and electronic devices nowadays it is very easy to learn and easy to use in indian languages because of these all standards and now i will <clears throat> sum up uh, all these standards and come back to today's topic without uh, the background of uh, standards of indian language computing 
you cannot understand the problems and solutions of using indian languages okay let me come back to the pada pad madam can you see the pada pada pad uh, yes sir editor yes, sir. yes that's where the importance of this script comes hitherto i have explained you the concepts of the languages and the keyboard script is there to select our language based on the selection of the language the combination keyboard has also has its own importance for rendering it is up to you to select the keyboard layout here since we are using nudi that is kp rao it is by default i have set the default language is kannada so let me change this to telugu now because in my previous class i have shown you how to use kannada up and down i have given the demo of kannada now let me go for this telugu just i will click telugu for the convenience of the display the font size is 72 what is the font name madam uh, font, font name. name is nothing it is not shown yeah it is not shown this is the beauty of this editor now just i will simply press a key mm. as you know the environment of this pad has been set to telugu script and the keyboard is nudi layout and the font size is 72 but the font is now unknown i don't know let me see let me give a test to this pad which font it is going to select i have not selected by default it is not there everything is right now just i will press k now what it has come kannada uh, has come mm. kannada has come let us uh, let me see what has what has happened this is telugu but uh, unfortunately kannada script is coming Let me cross check what is wrong with this. Okay. Generally, I will be using two tools at a time. If I use two tools, it will get clashed. Mm -hmm. Deliberately, I am simply doing this blindly because let us check here. Here, can you see here? Yes, sir. IME is also on, on. and the pad is also on. So the IME is overriding this pad. Mm. Can you understand the concept? Mm. Now, what is the setting of this IME? Let me check. Ha! Ah, it is mm. that's why it is overriding that pad. Now, what I have to do? Either I have to use only pad. or i have to use only ime isn't it mm. why i am using ime input method editor input method editor is a device it's a feature which supports typing of indian languages all these languages in any other applications of windows okay yeah. whereas this pada pad is a word processor itself no need to go for a ms word he, here it is itself so two things are getting clashed that's why deliberately i had kept this on just to explain you the concept of the clash now what i am going to do just i will quit here okay madam yes sir means uh, whenever we are using ms word we have to activate uh, ime for other you indian are, languages you right 100% you right. uh -huh. this is a local environment pada pad is a local environment whereas ime is a global environment mm. what the point yes sir so here, here, here we have selection for other languages everything is shown here so there is yes. no necessity yes, for right. ime correct correct the thing is the environment clash is there then what happens uh, when the environment clash is there definitely the ime global thing will take over surely you know uh, global is a bigger superset where under that our national things will come 
under that our states will come isn't it subsets likewise in indian language computing also a global thing is ime input method editor developed by uh, indian language computing expert mr lohit d shivamurthy and he has set the environment like this now now i don't have a separate ime here isn't it what i have got i have got only pad here i will space here now let me test give it to this i will press once again ka now what it came and telugu ka naturally it should come telugu ka should come it has come now previously there was a override by the operating system windows it was using the ime settings now the ime has been shut down quit now the script selected here is telugu keyboard selected is nudi now this is activated there is no clash now hope you got the concepts understood properly yes sir now the environment is fine see this is the beauty of the concept here ka is also there this is also there then no font setting so i will select both these things i will set one single font. i will try to set the single font akshar unicode see akshar unicode the entire font style changed so the uh, akshar unicode is developed by a telugu guy try to understand a telugu guy of course he has provided kannada also now i will select this and i will go for this brh telugu let me try what happens brh telugu baraha this is baraha font baraha telugu this is baraha kannada baraha kannada is catering for both telugu and kannada i will go to this lohit telugu this is lohit telugu can you differentiate between the visibility of kannada font and telugu font difference is there the style is same the difference you can make out the difference very easily see this is see this is ka the style has changed kannada and telugu and of course this is nirmal change see the beauty is keep kept on changing you know it is keeping changed so beauty is according to the style the design of the font name but the en encoding is same the style is same arial unicode is there i will select this arial unicode the size and space is changing the style is changing but the character is not changing right this is the beauty of indian language and if you want to type english k here what i have to do i will go here i will set here english or i can directly type f11 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 just it is a toggle key between english and indian languages f11 or otherwise i can set here also now if i press what happens madam i press k it will come english k okay okay what is the display of this english k here nirmal ui font what is this nirmal ui what all is are nirmal ui all are i will select all things now see the see the concept in this one single document in this one single page i am trying to use three languages kannada telugu and english and i have to type these languages by using only one single font that is the superset now nirmal ui is a system font provided by the microsoft the developer of this windows and developer of microsoft that is ms office microsoft office 
so operating system is by microsoft application is by microsoft and the font is also by microsoft so now i will select yeah, the things and i will change the font here now we can understand which font is bilingual which font is monolingual and which font is multilingual and of course already it is proven nirmal ui is multilingual if all these alphabets are seen as they are it is multilingual font if yes it you becomes, are right. uh, uh, some uh, Junk, junk. Yeah, See here the car. Yes, it is not. You are right. And uh, I wanted to. Uh, I tried to show this in Telugu also, but I could not get the hmm. the proper keyboard layout with proper old <coughs> font, which I type. But anyhow, that uh, that can be shown by using the Canada script now, junk characters. And I don't want to take uh, much time here. If at all it is there, the I will demonstrate here. I have kept it ready. Can you see here? Yes, sir. See, these are all the ASCII characters. Here it is. Nudi Akshar ten. I don't have Nudi Akshar ten. That's why it is not displaying. So it is displaying in something uh, English font. So if I change this to the proper font, take for example, I know this. This is Nudi. that's why i will go to this nudi font and i will select nudi font and then i can see this like this okay so and here i can space it out here for the newcomers those who have joined for this training class today only the newcomers you just see i i am spacing it out properly it is old fonts it is getting cut and they are becoming the bits and pieces the rendering is bits and pieces only not the complete syllables editing is very difficult just i wanted to show you like this the telugu also previously it was like this we were we only have developed this glyphs we call this as the piece of this which do not have any meaning independently this is called as a glyph glyph of ta and this is talakatto and i will raise this and this is space so i have to join this for proper rendering here and see editing is very difficult so it went off no i could not join that so this is what the problem so to overcome all these problems now i will show you the unicode concept here i am in english mode i will switch to the indian language mode control f11 and of course it is the script is in telugu i will change over here i will remove all these things this is kannada what is the font i will try to change the font see the style changed but not the letter not the char character ಕನ್ನಡ ಒಂದು ಸುಂದರ ಲಿಪಿ ಕನ್ನಡ ಅನ್ನೋದು ಒಂದು ಫಾಂಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇದೆ ಸುಂದರ ಲಿಪಿ ಅಂತ ಅನ್ನೋದು ಒಂದು ಫಾಂಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇದೆ ಸಿ ದ ಫಾಂಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಐ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಚೇಂಜ್ ದಿಸ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಯು ಕೆನಾಟ್ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಮೇ ಮೆನಿ ಫಾಂಟ್ಸ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪ್ಯಾಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪ್ಯಾಡ್ ಈಸ್ ಡಿಸ್ಪ್ಲೇಮಿಂಗ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ದೋಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾರೆಕ್ಟರ್ ಸೆಟ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಫಾಂಟ್ಸ್ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ಸಪೋರ್ಟ್ ಯುನಿಕೋಡ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಯುನಿಕೋಡ್ ಫಾಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಬೀಯಿಂಗ್ ಲಿಸ್ಟೆಡ್ ಹಿಯರ್ my dear viewers please try to understand here there is no old font set here 
see i will change this to kannada kuvempu my favorite font where is kuvempu kar kuvempu not listed now it is below this list kar gopal krishna bendre chandrashekar kambara where is kuvempu is missed i don't know how it happened uh, dara bendre okay fine this is also beautiful font bendre font see this is in ms shell dig this is in dara bendre this is in baraha kannada all are different different font styles but all are unicode only that's why this script pad that is uh, pada pad is rendering this beautifully okay let me try with the telugu font now some font setting may be there i will switch over to the telugu now now the nudi layout is there script is telugu i will try to use a telugu font directly here lohit himself himself has given a telugu i will use this why i am trying to use this means developer of this pad is lohit and lohit himself has given a telugu font it is my common belief that it will never give any problem it should not give any problem if any problem comes it is uh, the problem of the settings that's all not the problem of the developer or font okay let me check what is the environment now the font is lohit telugu the font size is 72 and the keyboard selected is nudi which i am well versed with that layout and the script is telugu i know a little bit of telugu based on the pronunciation i will type as if it is kannada <laughs> based on the sound so now okay what i have typed here madam telugu velugu telugu velugu right this is a very beautiful uh, slogan in uh, telugu that's why i typed here telugu velugu right and uh, whatever you say i can type now always i am very much interested to type my name as if i am a expert in telugu <laughs> fine see this is the pad here now i have one software here a ready file i have opened and i have kept it ready to show you certain things can you read madam yes sir i will increase the view no, here it's visible no problem it's visible for of course a zoom in i okay. will i will zoom in so that uh, view zoom in view zoom in okay it is here it is a telugu book which has come for kannada translation now i am on to this uh, telugu to kannada translation manas sarovara dhyanam ashram dhyana ashram uh, siddhartha pyramid dhyana mandiram ankitam this book is dedicated to someone so the dedication page is like this prishti lo rendu padalaku pratyam nyayam undadu undadam ha undadu ha okati amma rendu bharya janmistundi ha మూర్తి తెలుగు విచ్ ఈస్ వెరీ గుడ్ ఫాంట్ ఫర్ తెలుగు వెరీ బ్యూటిఫుల్ జస్ట్ ఐ విల్ కాపీ దిస్ టెక్స్ట్ so can you tell me what is the environment here i have opened this word pad it is word pad 
So the uh, file name is Manasa Sarovaram. Full text is file name. So the font is 11. I will increase the font now uh, to 28. Beautiful, isn't it? Now the font is Murthy Telugu. I will copy this Murthy Telugu and I will come to this Pada pad. Now I just copy this. What happened? No, oh, it has not copied properly. This is the old thing which is there in uh, not copied. I will go here, right click. I will copy it. Then I will come here. I will right click here and paste it here. Now it came, isn't it? Previously, it was not copied. It was properly. not copied. Whatever was there copied. in... Uh, yeah, yeah. It was not copied properly. Rendu Padaloko. I thought, let, let me take a small thing. Okay, okay. Then it is, now I have copied this. What is the font displayed here? It is in Telugu, Lohit Telugu. Lohit Telugu. Telugu, yeah. So now I will go to the script, change the English. I will try to understand. I typed here. Let me change the font size here. There is no substitute for mother. Okay. It's a text typed by me. What is the font here? It is Arial font. Arial. It has taken Arial. Very unfortunate. Why it should uh, take the Arial? Here it is Lohit Telugu. I will keep here. Now I will type here. Here it is Telugu Lohit. Here it is Arial. See, the developer is so smart. He has taken the Arial fonts. That's why automatically it went for Arial. Even the Arial font phase has been embedded into this Telugu font. This is bilingual now. If I select this, font change won't get Lohit Telugu. So Lohit Telugu has built-in English that is equivalent to Arial font. And this is Telugu Lohit. This is developed by Lohit, but this is not developed by Lohit. He has just put it onto his basket here. So now this is bilingual font I can call. Whereas this is not bilingual. Arial itself is only English. If I select this entire thing, and set for Arial. No, that Arial won't come here because it is not, Arial doesn't have Telugu. If I change this like this, so Telugu will get jumbled like this. So let us not do the experimentations. Even other things won't support because this Baraha Dev is meant for Hindi and the English. No, nothing. Because, because the selection is not allowed here. So if you select this Telugu only, see, automatically it changed. <laughs> Jumble up is over. Now, since I have selected only this Telugu, Telugu Lohit, now the list, it is not providing all the list of this, but uh, let me let me type here. What happened to my? Uh, just this is. What is this? This is also. Oh, everything has become single for Telugu Lohit. Okay. If I select this, can I select anything? No, the environment has been set. Something has happened here. Based on the script. I have, oh, I have, since I have selected the English, my dear viewers, be alert here. Since I have selected the English, 
the font is being shown only english only so if i go to telugu now the listing will come here definitely so all these fonts telugu support is here okay now the jumbled thing has been selected and now nirmal ui i selected the display is okay so depending upon the environment and the developer and the encoding is same based on the font and encoding and the developer's settings the rendering will happen so now i will end up my explanation regarding this font the font display the rendering of indian languages and two base languages that is kannada and telugu so i will sum up you just practice using this pada pad now the features are being explained to you pada pad is equal into other word processors like ms word but ms word has not built in uh, script software you have to add on uh, the imes based on the requirements of indian languages whereas the pada pad is def uh, uh, specifically developed for indian languages only that's why it has given a script uh, menu item all these script and the keyboard are here and the tools are there the very much important tool is unicode script converter is there i am very much interested in this converter and ansi to unicode converter these two features i am going to explain you now and all others are very common features and if you are well versed with usage of uh, indian languages uh, sorry usage of computers or digital um, gadgets you will be knowing how to handle that you are a computer literate take for example or otherwise you can assume that you are a computer expert you are expert in typing you are expert in using ms office especially the word for typing you are using word all word features are being used at the maximum level by you coloring uh, reducing the font size changing the fonts phases and aligning uh, and creating headings paragraphs indents uh, whatever it may be all these things are called as word processing features and you are expert in using that and uh, it is nothing to do with uh, the usage of indian languages or typing or fonts just a selection of fonts in english if you come to the indian language computing context you may have to select the proper font you may have to select the proper rendering engine that is ime in a uh, word environment and of course previously the uh, operating system windows and the application software ms office or ms word they were customized and of course they were not customized our indian language uh, software were customized to compatible to uh, suitable for the environment that uh, global environment nowadays no need to go for the compatibility problems because in the global level itself the standards have been set and the operating system is recognizing indian languages nowadays and only thing is you have to put the proper fonts that if the system doesn't have the proper font it will show you the boxes if the boxes are visible on uh, a particular application software then it means operating system can understand the encoding it is unicode but it doesn't have the proper font to display that is the situation now i want to show that environment that situation now i will close this i will say no to all i don't want any save here don't save anything i will just close everything now no save i don't want just i will go to word pad now word pad is a built in word processor given by the microsoft and mine is a 64 bit operating system windows operating system 
so this windows operating system itself has given a simple word processor by name wordpad so it's a blank document here here calibri is the font name and 72 is the font size and all my settings are indian language settings are nil now now i am trying to use this word processor if i press k directly k will come okay fine now i will try to enable my input method editor that is ime of my own my favorite ime which is word pad is it visible madam Ah, yes sir yes yes see tool tip you can read this what is this indic word processor pada if i mouse over here it is telling what it is pada ime yes i want it i launch this now now it has come here and it is sitting like this english environment this is pada ime i will click this and i will activate this activate yes launching is different activation is different now i activated and once again i will see what is the typing environment which language is default telugu who is default fine let it be as it is what is the keyboard kp rao keyboard is there yes it is my language uh, my required language my required key layout now everything is set for typing indian languages i will come over here i will make a space here i will just type k here what has come box a box has come why it has not displayed a telugu ka font is not available yes no it is there font it is, is not there. recognizing 100% you are right madam it is not it doesn't want to recognize this because it has not been bundled with the, the word pad word pad is a universal thing. which has it has come along with the windows operating system you have to tell this word pad in which language this display should be okay now i will select this now i will type one telugu word t telugu i have typed telugu but it has it is displaying 1 2 3 4 5 6 characters now i will select this and i will go to this and it is telling it is vani but it is very tricky it can identify vani it is not in a position to show display. so see this is the beauty of technology now i will tell you what is the environment i will explain you the environmental problem here for getting telugu display the operating system windows is understanding that this is unicode font and the word pad is also understanding this is in vani font font family but in my system i don't have vani font okay this is why it is displaying the box now i know but your system is my... having uh, some other uh, telugu font sir yes some other it will be there ah, okay, i will come to the point i will come to the point since it is a universal word pad is a operating level system uh, word processor word pad it will never be attached to any single font where in english it will be attached to by default calibri that's all the environment now i know i have installed many universal font that is unicode font for telugu i will just select it i know which is which has to be selected uh madam which font uh, should i select you tell me murti telugu yeah yeah that is very beautiful font previously i have sakala bharati yeah sakala bharati is also there oh, you have remind me the sakala bharati about that i will tell you Nudi Pari Jatra. Ah, see, I am trying try, trying to type this Murti, 
But it, it is coming in, in Telugu. Telugu. Because my typing environment is in Telugu, I will switch over to English mode now. Okay. Control F11. Murti Hindi. Murti Telugu. No, it has not been selected here. What happened to my Murti Telugu font? So, one second. I will select this. Murti Hindi is here. Kannada is also there. Murti Telugu is also. Okay, it is typing mistake only. I will select here. Beautiful. So, so beautifully, you can see here. Now it has displayed properly. Here you can see six keys are there, were there previously. Now, how many characters you can see? Three. Three characters. Three. This is Te, this is Lu, this is Gu, Telugu. For rendering these three syllables, six characters that we have used, isn't it? Yes, sir. Ta, oh, okay, it is in English mode now. I will switch over to Indian language mode, control F11. I will type once again, Ta. E T L U L U G U U G U C T E T even in English also we use T E T L U L U G U G U based on the phonetics because of this phonetics only this is very easy I am trying to type. See the beauty here once again. I will change. I will change the alert here. I will change this Murti Telugu to Murti Kannada. And I will change the IME settings to Kannada. Follow me carefully. Okay. Now I will type T E L U G U Telugu. What you are getting? In Canada. Canada script is being displayed here. This is Telugu script. This is Canada script. But the pronunciation is same. Very good. Same. So what is the implication here? It doesn't take uh, the font by itself. Yes, it cannot change the font itself. As a you user, understand. I have to change the font and I have to change the language. Then only it can understand. Now, I will come to Word now, MS Word. Okay. So, let me close everything here. This is old one. I don't want. Afresh, I will type. Oh, Word closed. Of course, here this word is just I will try. I don't want to uh, because my word environment is only set for Canada and uh, Canada and Unicode, but not the Telugu. Anyhow, the view has to be changed here. I will zoom it properly. Okay. Home. I will change the font size. So the font calibre right now. Okay. So what is this application? Microsoft Word. Okay. Then the Word document is here. If I press K now, what comes? Here, what is my environment? Let me see. It is activated. The language is Canada. And keyboard is? Uh, okay. Uh, just I will press K. We are supposed to get what? Canada. Ka. I got it. Beautiful. Then you tell me in which uh, font automatically it has displayed? Nirmal, you are. Yes, you are good. You are perfectly right. You have told me the right answer. See here, Word is an advanced word processor, MS Word. It is recognizing 
the encoding system and it is recognizing the language and it is recognizing the font also the font is developed by the microsoft they have bundled it based on our user settings they are able to display here since it is a independent app application this has not bundled with the operating system the operating system wordpad has been kept independent whereas the ms word by default it is showing nirmal font okay now just i will remove this back okay i will change the font it was previously like this i will change the language setting here so now i will press k what i was supposed to take uh, get and madam uh, telugu you selected sir yes i have selected the telugu language uh, okay. okay now the font is in calibri uh, now i am in indian language mode if i press k according to my rendering of the keyboard uh, that is uh, kpirav layout if i press k i am supposed to get telugu ka for so calibri it doesn't come ha huh? let so, me check uh, let me check no i will tell you it will come <laughs> okay because because the encoding system it can understand this is this is indian language telugu okay. mm. since since the nirmal ui has been bundled with this operating system definitely this will display will come in telugu now okay. the font will be naturally the bundled font okay. which is that it will start showing nirmal ui here definitely okay. see yes it took the nirmal ui this is the developers settings environment oh. now as a user i am using the indian language script ime by name pada and the pada is being built on the standards unicode standards it has multiple languages it has multiple fonts also and it has got unicode encoding system that can be understood by both Uh, windows and also word now so oh, what is this kannada nudi vandu sundara nudi yeah the language is in kannada script is in telugu ha script is telugu if i type like this in kannada one page the person who do not know kannada script can read one who knows the telugu he can read this very easily he can understand kannada but cannot read the kannada script he is a telugu guy well versed in telugu but he can understand kannada but he can't read script kannada then what is the situation for him if i provide this he can read this properly kannada nudi vandu sundara nudi beautiful now reverse i will i will i will shut down i will change my environment to kannada now i am trying to introduce the concept of transliteration now just to follow my explanation i am showing you i am demonstrating the concept of transliteration here now i will change my language setting kannada now madam i want your help mm. can you translate this and tell me in uh, telugu kannada nudi pakka kannada nudi okay sundara nudi sundara nudi okay only one has been changed all <laughs> other everything is same see how similarity is sundara there sundara maina nudi we can say ah very good sundara maina nudi okay improved uh, i don't know much of all uh, other ways we can take another uh, example now as usual why it is coming like this because this is rendering problem in uh, 
what is the problem here to see the settings no the setting is not not the setting here nirmal font okay yeah. i will i will show this uh, in it is my problem here my system problem here it is nothing to do with this uh, uh, rendering and all one second i have the problem with the settings here i will i will set it right not coming no not coming it is the problem with my word not problem with any software the version of word is old let me go back to my word pad word pad okay the concepts will be very clear here oh time is up you know it is 822 fine i will finish off uh, the concept of uh, mm, what should be my font font nirmal ui nirmal ui because it will cater for both kannada and telugu telugu that's why uh, english also kannada now what is the setting here english i will activate this now what is the setting let me understand kannada kannada okay in kannada madam can you tell me what i have typed here na peru e satya narayana e satya narayana लांग्वेज इन telugu fine i will show you one concept here now i have one page of telugu text i cannot read telugu script speedily but i can recognize telugu i want to read speedily i will convert the telugu script into kannada script but the telugu language will be like that only okay so here let me switch over here the recent one already it is there manasa sir text ah huh? manasa sir manasa sarovar i will take this now i am coming to the concept of how a script software like pada will give me the entire page or the entire thing in kannada so where is that that first one yeah the first one only i have practiced it you know that's why i am well versed with this paragraph i copied it copy and i will come to our my favorite pada element here just i will paste it here what happened hmm. madam it has come it has come good it has come it is visible very much okay beautifully see i will i will try to read this manasa sarovara ana ashramam siddhartha pyramid dhyana mandiram ankitam सृष्टि रे पदाल प्रत्यम प्रत्यांग रीडिंग इन कन्ड See the beauty. We are, we are, uh, my dear viewers, 
be alert here what i am trying to show you is the entire telugu script what you are looking at it will be converted into kannada script but the language remains the same this is called transliteration okay the concept of transliteration is being demonstrated from my side try to understand this the environment is pada pad <coughs> here i have copied one text uh, one paragraph to, two paragraphs of uh, telugu text here onto this this is unicode text now i am trying to override the text convert this text into kannada script so let let me go to this script this is telugu now i will go to this tools unicode script converter is there i will select this option so here the source is telugu madam is it visible ah yes, sir yes sir visible ah. source source is telugu it is explaining you something about this the conversion and all you can read this and uh, i know uh, what it is i am not going to read this you please read it read this what is the destination here destination is kannada kannada okay so if i press k okay what will happen telugu gets converted to kannada whether language no script yes exactly you are right language remains the same mm -hmm. the script will be changed okay i will press okay now now the miracle will happen done yes yes now see here two tabs have been created this is untitled 0 untitled 2 untitled means it is not saved one here it is telugu here it is kannada see the beauty okay you have both also yes both also here mm. that original is also there here mm. kannada item now i will try to uh, read it of course for my convenience i will increase the font size and some here and there all uh, mistakes are there don't worry about it okay that is inverted comma problem yes manasa sarovara dhyana ashramam siddhartha dhya mid dhyana mandiram ankitam srushti lo rendu padalaku pratyamnyayam oh beautifully i can recognize it is mage idu natu anta i recognize this beautifully pratya pratyamnyayam undadu okati amma rendu bharya jenmis bharya jenmistundi uh amma amma word is missing sir there yeah one word has been missing i don't know uh idi uh, idi this was supposed to be uh, bharya is okay rendu bharya here amma should be there i typed it <laughs> amma janma istundi right yes sir it should not amma be jenmistundi janma istundi yeah exactly you are right janma istundi ah okay i will correct it here amma janma istundi <laughs> see the beauty <laughs> though okay i don't want to save that this is how i, I have to correct amma janma istundi bharya ajanmantam premistundi so beautiful okay so the difference between mother and wife so now i can understand what exactly in this ankitam the writer want to convey to me i don't know telugu i cannot uh, read fast but now i can understand telugu i can read fast by uh, converting this telugu script into my own script that is kannada script uh, language srushti lo rendu padavu pratyamnyayam undadu okati amma rendu bharya amma janma istundi bharya ajanmananta ప్రేమిస్తుంది ఇద్దరి లక్ష్యం ఒకటే నిన్ను ప్రేమించమే అందుకే అమ్మను అనాథ చేయవద్దు భార్యను వాట్ ఈస్ దిస్ మేడం బానిస అంటారు ఈస్ దట్ వర్డ్ ఈస్ కరెక్ట్ బానిసేవ్ ఐ డోంట్ నో బానిస మీనింగ్ భార్యను బానిస చేయవద్దంటారు yes yes bharya that wife wife should not be uh, considered as a slave wife. here banisa if i don't know the meaning of banisa i will go to the dictionary of telugu dictionary i will try to understand the meaning of banisa and i will ask some other persons banisa so, 
దిస్ ఈస్ ఎ స్టాండర్డ్ వర్డ్ ఓకే అద్భుతమైన జన్మనిచ్చిన నా తల్లి తండ్రులకు తండ్రులకు ఇట్ హాస్ బికమ్ ఇట్ హాస్ ఇట్ షుడ్ బికమ్ తండ్రులకు అనుక్షణం నాతో నడుస్తూ ప్రతి క్షణం నాలో వెలుగులు నింపే దవత వట్ ఈస్ దిస్ దవత లాంటి నా భార్యకు కుటుంబ సభ్యులకు ఆధ్యాత్మిక జీవితానికి అర్థం పరమార్థం తెలిపి నా లక్ష్యాన్ని గమ్యాన్ని తెలుగుతో నన్ను నడిపిస్తున్న గురుదేవులు జగద్గురువు బ్రహ్మహర్షి పత్రీజీ గారికి దేహ బంధువుల ప్రేమను పొందిన నాకు ఆత్మ బంధువుల ఆత్మీయతను ఆచరణాత్మకంగా ఆచరి చూపుతున్న ఆత్మస్వరూపాలందరికీ శిరస్సు వంచి చేతులు జోడిస్తూ నా ఈ ఆత్మకథను అంకితం చేస్తున్నాను సి ఐ కెన్ అండర్స్టాండ్ దిస్ అండ్ హియర్ అండ్ దేర్ సమ్ టైపోగ్రాఫికల్ ఎరర్స్ మై మైట్ బి దేర్ సో హియర్ తల్లి దండ్రు వాజ్ దేర్ తల్లి తండ్రు ఐ డిట్ వాట్ ఈస్ ద ఒరిజినల్ థింగ్ హియర్ దేర్ ఆల్సో ఇట్ ఈస్ ద యా దిస్ హియర్ వితౌట్ చేంజింగ్ ఎనీథింగ్ జస్ట్ ఐ విల్ టైప్ వేర్ ఇట్ ఈస్ మేడం హియర్ దండ్రు yeah i will keep here i will do it tandru so the mode is in telugu uh, sorry kannada i will change that to you know telugu without changing the talli tand tandruluku tand beautifully mm. see now i am an expert <laughs> in indian languages i can correct telugu also based on the sound so here the beauty lies my dear viewers it's okay this is in telugu this in kannada this is called transliteration transliteration in between uh, telugu and kannada from telugu to kannada now i will choose more script override i will go to this unicode script and i will change the destination here so be careful here shall i go to hindi because i can read hindi <laughs> that's why i will go to hindi now now what will happen madam it gets converted to hindi hindi the language remains the same the script will be changed to hindi, hindi. yes one more file has been created here beautiful see here the original is telugu telugu kannada kannada this is hindi okay now manas sarovar dhyan what is this ashram ashram ashramam ashramam exactly ha uh, uh, of course the same thing uh hindi i can nice but speedily i cannot read okay so if you read this a person who do not know the script of telugu but he knows uh, his mother tongue is hindi but he can understand telugu if you this page to a such guy he will read beautifully in his own script and he can understand uh, the written uh, uh, message by a telugu master see this where the technology will play a very good role the person who knows two languages but cannot read a single uh, can read only one script he can convert this into his own script and he can read any number of newspapers any number of his uh, uh, beloved novels uh, and anything he can read this is the beauty of the technology and this is called transliteration now i will come to the point Modi ji has visited uh, Mysore recently on the occasion of okay i will switch over to my camera mode because i wanted to talk to you international yoga day yeah i want to uh, explain you the concept of this transliteration and the need for translation as uh, sorry transliteration uh right now i wanted to give you an example of our honor prime minister uh, he impresses uh, the regional language people wherever he goes 
by speaking in their own languages i don't think our honorable prime minister is well versed with all languages but he at least put his effort using this technology isn't it and we will get related to our honorable prime minister if he speaks in my own language isn't it people get connected to him yeah yeah we will get connected to him he will get connected to us this is the affiliation at least he begins his speech by uttering uh, some words sentences sometimes some paragraphs also one paragraph also by practicing by using this teleprompter and all so the technocrats the technology experts they provide the proper language script proper language script once again i am telling in his own choice of his own take for example hindi or maybe it, it is gujarati also i don't know generally hindi he is well versed in in hindi if he goes to uh, andhra pradesh or telangana the telugu language will be provided in hindi script and if he comes to karnataka the kannada language will be given in the hindi script he practices the pronunciation properly and he will win the hearts of the local people so this is the best example of the need for transliteration not only for impression impressing the people if you want to stand a beautiful novel which is in kannada you are a telugu person it is in kannada if at all the digital copy of that uh, beautiful novel take for example uh, sl bhairappa's novels are very famous across india though you do not know the language uh, or uh, script you know uh, you can understand the language kannada language you try to read that by using the transliteration script that is possible you forget about the lang- uh, novels at least for a pamphlet a information a bit uh, piece of information transliteration will come for the help i will tell you in my own house i have one uh, atta grinding machine mm-hmm. which has been brought from ahmedabad he has given the user manual in gujarati and hindi and of course i am illiterate about both the languages but a little bit of hindi i can understand just took one google lens i just took the i captured that hindi and i get converted uh, translation is also possible transliteration is also possible by using this technology i just read it i, I understood and i tried to set right my machine that is issue issue is different if you want to go to any other state google lens is with you means it will give you the translation also today uh, i have come to the uh, end of this session now i have introduced you the major and very important uh, feature of this pada software that it will provide you the transliteration of the scripts indian languages not only rendering the indian language scripts that is typing by using one single key keyboard layout and single script software you are learning how to type it in windows environment not only typing but you have learned today how to convert the script from one language script to another language script which is called transliteration now i will end my session here transliteration is possible in pada software for which we have to use one pada and uh, and copy this onto any software i will show you from this uh, i will i can copy here here only it is telugu is here now below that the hindi is here telugu is here hindi is here if i want kannada also i can come here where is kannada second, second one. one very good yes i will type type this and i will copy this i will go to this word and i will 
first it is telugu second wherever you want you can put it okay next to telugu i will put kannada oh something has happened some mistake is happened uh, I, i can understand what is the mistake this is the mistake our word not the mistake of this thing word is not properly it is not rendering i will try i will try with uh, any other software it is like that only wow <laughs> ah nudi parichat nudi parijata very good madam is very fast she recognized the <laughs> the font and uh, the rendering uh, is also very important nudi parijata is perfectly rendering uh, this kannada when compared to other fonts nudi parijata is very strong in kannada we can understand the concept here if i go to this uh, nirmal ui or other things those fonts are failing in this environment isn't it it is failing yes sir so if i go to this lohit also it is failing because of some technical incompatibility between the word and the font so nudi parijata is very beautifully it is getting gelled what about uh, this um, let me have one test here what about our uh, murti kannada font madam can i try this uh, murti murti kannada yes this is also it very comes. beautifully rendering mm -hmm. now we can conclude by this experiment that um, nudi parijata and murti kannada font are well uh, developed font and very uh, scientifically very technologically well built fonts because it is rendering properly when compared to the font developed by our uh, microsoft people now also i don't blame microsoft people because since i am an expert microsoft people they keep on experimenting this is the problem with uh, the microsoft uh, word 2010 it is 32 uh, bit operating system if you go to the 34 uh, bit operating system this will render properly i can i should not blame uh, microsoft also because the uh, world is older version and uh, i can color up that uh, our nudi people that they have developed a beautifully compatible to both uh, 64 bit and 34 bit old and new that is why i recommend uh, always use murti kannada font or murti uh, sorry uh, nudi parijata font for unicode it is beautifully well built so thank you i will sum up now it uh, is almost uh, uh, deepthi has uh, raised a hand shall we unmute her sir uh, one second i will come to the zoom mode okay i will close down everything now then only i will be comfortable to answer all the questions okay madam anyhow up to uh, we will ask her to unmute sir and ask her question one second one second one second i will come i will come return to meeting i will come uh okay i will close my sharing stop sharing now now i am back i am visible to you madam okay madam deepthi please namaste sir namaste madam namaste you are from bangalore sir bangalore here only okay sir actually yes. you are giving classes in english also sir yes madam i used to conduct the classes in english also today i have announced the the subject is same previously in my previous class that is last saturday i have explained all these concepts in kannada by using this uh, kannada demo and telugu demo this class the same topics are being explained in english okay your explanation this, uh, very nice will be available for your future use also yes sir yes tell me madam and this uh, nudi parjata is only for uh, particular language sir or, uh, or... Yes. 100% right madam you are right 
Nudi Parijata is for Kannada only. It is bilingual, beautiful bilingual. It is multilingual. Uh, technically, it is multilingual, but built for bilingual usage. Whereas uh, the Telugu font provided by the Microsoft, it is universal font. It will cater for all Indian languages, wherein Kannada, Telugu, English, common font is there. You can choose the bilingual font in English environment, English and Telugu one. That is Murthy is there. I recommend Murthy Telugu. Adam, I have got a lot of uh, Telugu fonts with me, Unicode fonts. I don't have time to display now. I will take this issue in my next class. I will phone the thing to the next class. You please join to my next class. I will show or you can do your, your uh, experiments on your own. Okay. Okay, so yes. how can we can how we'll get that uh, all types different types of fonts into Word document or and, uh, even Android phone also we can get uh, all together. Hundred percent, madam. Android. Uh, you are talking about the phone, madam. Yes. Now my next issue itself is phone only. On phone that is smartphones. How to use Indian languages? That will be the my next topic. So there comes the important handwriting input. That is by using the fingers on the screen, we will write the technology is old now. And we have, we have you, uh, the opportunity of using the keyboard key presses that is outdated now on Android or iPhone uh, smartphones. We have now the voice typing given by the respective operating system providers. Okay. Okay, sir. And uh, actually, my doubt is uh, uh, how uh, all the different types of fonts you are getting in Word document, right? In computer font, font is the font issue of font is regarding the beauty of the script. It pertains only to the desktop and uh, DTP works and printing. There is uh, nothing to do with the printing in our uh, smartphones. Our smartphones will be having only one built-in uh, font which is uh, no other styles will be available. It is readable fonts, Unicode fonts, that's all. Okay, okay, thank you. Sir, what she is asking beauty is... And all, you, have to use, uh, you have to use PDF, PDF uh, uh, rendering and uh, you can convert the PDFs uh, to your um, uh, smartphone or internet purposes like that. Yeah, tell me, um, uh, Madam Mamata, Madam was telling What something. I understood from Deepthi Madam was, she is asking if Nudi Parijata, Murti, Telugu, such fonts, have, we have to install it or will it be there inbuilt in built-in? Uh, yes, no, correct, correct, no, no, correct. No, no, it has to be installed. Yes. Okay. See, the Microsoft people, they have given the environment for us, the technology they have given, they have created the space. And we have to create our own fonts. So in uh, uh, Telugu environment, uh, Telugu computing experts, they know which one is uh, the sturdy, the beautiful font, font phases. I have a uh, good number of Telugu fonts with me. I can share you or you can go to the internet and you can search for such uh, uh, free fonts and you can download it and install onto your desktop. And of course, don't try to install the fonts to your mobile phones. It is not possible also. It is not supported also. Okay, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Don't miss my classes in the next uh, coming days because no knowledge will go waste and nobody will take this much of pain and uh, interview explain in detail. Even if you uh, pay money, nobody is conducting the classes on Indian language computing technology in uh, this level, in this um, way. Okay, yes. yes, yes, I I, yes, sir. Uh, Excellent I, I, I class, am, sir. Your yes, class is I am, I am, I am doing this not because of any other thing. I want to disseminate the knowledge which I have gained uh, in the area of Indian computing technology, and I have done my uh, doctorate degree in this with special reference to Canada. And uh, my uh, selfish uh, intent is uh, under the banner of this PSSM movement. I want to create the volunteers who are well versed with the technology 
of converting the telugu script uh, i mean telugu language scripts into kannada language transliteration translation transcription and everything that is what the intention behind this and this will definitely be, will be useful to all others also who are very much interested to learn uh, the indian language computing not only typing but also uh in in the all applications of the smartphones and uh, desktops and even the unemployed employees can set up their own employment they set up their own enterprises to become self employed and if at all anybody uh, is a professional he will gain indian language computing technology tricks and uh, uh, skill set his skill set will be improved a lot okay thank you thank yes. you yes thank you very much sir thank you very much thank you one and all namaste to everybody sir thank you very much sir it was extraordinarily good sir today uh, yes, we learned sir. a lot thank you sir yeah, i have done i have um, uh, my preparation was excellent today so i have delivered uh, <laughs> the proper books now transliteration was uh, beautiful sir. beautiful madam is it that and even the demo also yes uh and now one should use this madam yes sir. should understand the concept one should use this and the application and uh, in in next coming classes i will introduce the new applications the google has given the beautiful technology solutions no need to type any indian languages if you uh by typing uh, yeah yeah I, I, that that is what in my next class i am introducing uh voice typing now okay sir. one so, last question sir nirmal ui is there in all uh, desktops and uh, uh, laptops no sir in yeah. built nirmal ui is available yeah it is available by so default can, it is uh, there we can practice uh, these things uh, without installing any like uh, fonts Definitely. like uh, murti telugu sakala bharati nudi parichata yeah so not ui yet. is enough for practice yeah it is enough but uh, the tool Mm. that is keyboard driver is very very essential for you yes yes and of course windows uh, microsoft people have given indian language uh, tools only thing is you have to go to the settings language regional language settings and you have to add the keyboard of your, your choice no pada we no. have uh, installed pada yeah that is why that is why don't mm. experiment if you are new to indian language computing typing don't experiment other keyboard layouts because you will get confused don't for indian languages learning indian languages through english yes. k a n n a d a if you type k a n n a d a kannada will come but uh, the thinking thought process will go i say i r k i n r i you type it by using the transliteration keyboard you fail there in typing if you learn kannada typing kannada in kannada of course phonetically it will be very easy that's why only one script software only one keyboard layout for all in languages this is the concept so if Don't we experiment. start pada and if we have uh, uh, operating system in 64 bits that is yeah. enough to practice that is enough yes madam yes yes see since from nine classes i have been uh, explaining the concepts and of course bilingual four classes in kannada four classes in, in english only in four classes or eight hours i have given you the entire concept of typing keyboard uh, this is rendering display font uh, and uh, uh, the approach of uh, problems and solutions so today i will end this only the uh, font to uh, ascii to unicode conversion is left out next classes i will cover it up also no problem thank you everybody thank you sir thank you very much uh, at thank the you. end uh, uh, i to thank this uh, pyramid call services bengaluru for providing me this platform for this uh, uh, classes online classes thank you one and all namaste